Hey, how's it going everyone? This is the Anime Man, and whoa, welcome to fucking Final Fantasy VI. Uh, okay, so, the story goes that I dug up my old Super Nintendo, or my uncle's old Super Nintendo the other day, and I went on a fucking massive nostalgia trip and played this game, and I thought, I really want to do a Let's Play on this series, because it is literally my favorite game of all time. And so I asked you guys on Facebook and Twitter about it, and uh, you guys were really super supportive about it, so I'm like, fuck it. I'm already doing, like, 50 series right now, but I'm gonna do this one too. So here we are. We are playing my one of my all-time favorite games, Final Fantasy VI. This is the advanced version, um, because, you know, I figured I could play the original Super Nintendo version, although that's technically Final Fantasy III. Um, yeah, it's a little bit confusing like that, uh, but I decided to do the advanced version because I personally play this one more than the Super Nintendo version, and also this is just better graphics. So yeah, guys. Holy shit, we're playing Final Fantasy VI. So, um, yeah, this is gonna be a long ass fucking game, guys. Um, of course, I am gonna skip, like, grinding. Um, but, uh, yeah. Let's just fucking play. I love this game so much. The ancient war of the Magi, when its flames at last receded, only the changed husk of the world remained. Even the power of magic was lost. I should do this in like a narrative voice. In the thousand years that followed, iron, gunpowder, and steam engines took the place of magic, and life slowly returned to the barren land. Look at these graphics, bruh. Yet there now stands one who would reawaken the magic of ages past, and use its dread power as a means by which to conquer all the world. Now guys, I have, although this is one of my favorite games of all time, um, and it is a lot of, and it is the favorite game for a lot of my friends, um, could anyone truly be foolish enough to repeat that mistake? Yeah, I was saying, um, this is like my favorite game, um, but I never actually finished it. Yeah, I know. I've gotten so close, but I've never actually finished this game, so I'm hoping you guys will join me on this adventure to finally beat my childhood game. Um, yeah. Here we go. Also, I haven't played this game in years, so there's a lot of things I've forgotten. I've pretty much forgotten most of it. That's the city. Hard to believe an Esper's been found frozen there for a thousand years after the War of the Magi. Ah, probably just another wild goose chase. I don't know. They wouldn't have let us use her unless they were confident that the information was good. Ah yes, our witch. I hear she fried 50 of our Magitek armored soldiers in 3 minutes. Kinda makes your skin crawl, don't it? Relax, with that thing on her head, she's a mindless puppet. The girl won't even breathe unless we tell her to. We'll approach from the east. Move out! Alright. Finally beginning. So yeah, um... This, like, look, like... When this fucking first cutscene came out on the Super Nintendo, everyone was shitting their pants. Because it's like, whoa, it's like, semi-3D, kind of. Of course, this is on the Game Boy Advance, but like... This is a port of the, uh, I'm just gonna skip all that, because that's just the opening credits. It's unimportant. Alright, so, uh, final claim. The girl takes point, and don't waste time on the riffraff. Remember what we're here for. Let's move! Alright, here we go. I'm playing as this girl. Um, so, we're gonna run into some things here. Hello? Imperial Magistic Armor! Not even Nash is safe anymore. Let's fight. So, uh, this first part is pretty much just, like, to teach you, um, some things. Of course, it's pretty, like, yeah, you wreck them. Look at this. Boom. Get shrinked. <laughs> 32. Beast gained a level. Wage gained a level. 1096 skill. Alright. So, uh, yeah, um, this is, uh, 
not only my favorite game, but is also a uh, favorite game for a lot of my friends to, um, if you guys know, um, I believe my friend Gabigli, uh, and also the beta cat, Derek, um, this is their favorite game as well, and, um, you know what? How is it not? Now, a lot of people say that Final Fantasy VII was the best, uh, Final Fantasy game ever made, but... As much as I like Final Fantasy VII, I have to disagree. I do truly believe that this game, Final Fantasy VI, was the best Final Fantasy. Um, and also, if you guys don't know, I'm a huge Final Fantasy fan just in general. I've played all the Final Fantasy games, um, regardless of whether I finished them. I've played all the Final Fantasy games up to 12. Um, uh, my good friend Ray uh, recently bought me Final Fantasy XIII on Steam, so if you guys want to see me play that as well, then I'd, very, I'd be very happy to play it. If not, then I'm always planning to stream it uh, if my internet can actually handle it. But uh, yeah, we're just going to skip over these uh, fight scenes, and because, uh, you know, not much else happens uh, besides all this kind of stuff, so uh, yeah. See you guys in a bit. Look at these motherfuckers. Megalodon. I'm gonna take those guys out first, uh, because they're a little bit heavier duty than the guards, even though I'm gonna Shrek them regardless. Um, so yeah, if you got you guys are probably wondering, um, you know, why is this my favorite game? Or why is this my favorite Final Fantasy game? Um, I don't know, it's just, I think, you know, gameplay-wise, there's not much different between Final Fantasy VI and the rest of the Final Fantasies, but I think what made Final Fantasy VI so uh, much better and well-received compared to the other Final Fantasy games was that it just, it had so much of a better story, I think, uh, which you're about to see right now. Alright, according to our source, they unearthed the frozen Esper in a new mine shaft they were digging. This must be it. Alright, and also I think the one thing that stood out uh, about this game in particular, uh, here's a save point, Strange Light fills the air, do you want to learn save points? No, we know about save points. Alright, so, so these places we can save, boom, game saved, cool, alright, uh, I'm just going to check actually, yeah I'm a little bit low on health aren't I, but I should be alright. Okay, yeah, and also, um, I was saying the one thing that definitely stood out about this particular Final Fantasy game is the music, which you are, you guys are going to see right about, well, after this battle. Oh, look at these were-rats. You Get the fuck out of here, bitches. You are disturbing. It's like a grosser version of Eradicate. I do not want this as a Pokemon, just saying. Yeah, I'm glad they kept these kinds of guys in Final Fantasy. <laughs> Even winning the battle feels good with this victory thing. Alright, so we're about to encounter a boss right here. I'll handle this, stay back. Shebang. Alright, so you guys are about to see right now, uh, there's a boss right up through here. And the boss battle music is probably the best piece of gaming music ever made. So here we go. We're not handing over the Esper! Ymir, get them! Here we go. Listen to this shit. Oh my god, I love it so much. Hold it! This thing's a... They must have trained it to guard the mines. Da, 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 da. You, I can't not get excited to this song. It's just fucking awesome. I wish every, I wish every fight had this music because I never get bored of this song. What are you talking about? You know what this is? I've heard of a lightning. Ever heard of a lightning whelk? It's a monster that absorbs lightning da, 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 and stores the energy in its shell. Right. So whatever you do, don't attack the shell. Got it! Alright, let's fight it! Okay, so, Ymir is pretty easy. Uh, he's the first boss fight. Um, so pretty much, he is going to, or it, 
is going to go into its shell. Um, oh. oh, you bastard. Now I'm slow. Oh. No, shit. Okay. I, so I accidentally hit the shell. It does damage, but then I'm going to get Mega Bolted. And I'm probably going to die. Oh, crap. No, god damn it. I'm fucked. I just fucked myself. <laughs> GG. Alright. I don't have a Phoenix down, do I? I don't think I have a Phoenix down. Uh, so yeah, as you can see... Uh, oh, I have a cure, though. Uh, okay, I don't have a Phoenix down, unfortunately. So... So we're just fucked. Um, okay, so... As you can see, while he's in the shell, I can't attack him. Um, but now that he's out of the shell, I can fucking fire away. I mean, it's not... This boss isn't difficult, it's just a little bit annoying. Um, especially since I've been slimed as well. Oh, come on, no, 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 come on, come on, get him before you- fuck. Okay, that's what's also- that, that's what was also difficult about, uh, this game. Is that, when you- it's like, I don't know, it's like, um, I don't know, it's- it's like, it's like turn-based and real-time at the same time. It's kind of weird. Um, so, I- you have to, like, strategically plan when you are going to attack. Uh, I'm going to use the healing force. So as you can see, while we wait, we can heal each other. Um, and then there we go. He comes out. Uh, come on. And then I can quickly fire beam in. Get him. Should be done soon. Hopefully. Oh. Yeah, so see, shit like that is, uh... So during this time, unfortunately, I can't bring Wedge back. If Wedge was still alive, then I probably would have beaten him by now, but... You know, shit happens. Yeah, I can't... I don't have any Phoenix down, so I can't bring him back to life, but... Yeah, he's coming back, so I'm gonna use a Bio Blast on him. Uh, maybe that wasn't a good idea, actually. Yeah. Although it's got Mega Bolted. Damn it. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't a good He's almost dead soon, anyway. Yeah, there we go. Got him. But how good is the fucking music? It is awesome. I love this song. Yeah, we got him. It's all G. Yay. So, yeah, that was kind of a boss. It's supposed to be a boss, but, you know, it is the first boss, so it's pretty easy. Uh, oops. This is the way. Um, I think there's a... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's this guy. So this is the Frozen Esper. What the hell, Wedge? I thought you died. Whatever. <laughs> oh, he's the Frozen Esper. This thing's giving me the creeps. Something's not right. Frozen creature beings are meeting an eerie light. Where's that light coming from? Ah! Oh, see a wedge. What was that? Wedge? Wedge, where are you? Hey, what's going on? And you're fucked. <laughs> well, I'm still alive. I think sure he's creepy. Whoa, what's going on? Oh, and I exploded. GG me. Now, if this is the first time you're watching Final Fantasy VI and you're confused right now, don't worry. It all makes sense pretty soon. Alright, so here I am. Where am I? My, my. And I just removed the crown. My head... Oh, that's a very cool graphical thing. 
Easy there. There is a this is a slave crown. The others were using it to control you. It was robbing you of your thoughts, making it so you wouldn't, so you'd do whatever you they told you. I can't remember a thing. Don't worry, I'll all come back to you in time. That is. Shake my head. A mysterious young woman born with the gift of magic and enslaved by the Gest Gestalian Empire. Terra. Yep, so her name is Terra. Um, I'm just gonna leave all the characters by default, because uniforms are born. It's funny actually because in the Japanese, the original Japanese Final Fantasy VI, her default name is Tina, not Terra. So that's kind of interesting, I thought. My name is Terra. Impressive, I've never heard of anyone recovering so fast. You must be made of tougher stuff than most. I love these dogs. Hear that 16-bit barking? Open up! We're here for the Magitek armor pilot! And that be me. Open this door right now and hand over that girl! She's an agent of the Empire! There's no time to explain. You need to get out of here. Those fools aren't going to listen to reason. This way, quickly. Alright. Fall on you, old man. Out we go. Oh, I'm GTFOing. See you later, bitches. Up there! She's like, oh shit. I'm out. Laters. In I go. Oh, and we're fine. Oh, there's a bandit and a spritzer. What was funny was that the bandits in the Japanese games were called highways. Like a highway bandit. I'm not joking, by the way. You should probably look it up. <laughs> they were totally called highways. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. I always thought that was interesting. Oh, I got a shield. So like I said, there is very little of this game I actually remember. I do remember Ymir, that's about it. I never could I could I never could pronounce Ymir by the way. Is it Ymir or is it like Ima or fuck I don't know. I, I don't know how to pronounce it. There's a save point. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save right here guys. Yes. Cool. Alright guys, well, uh, that was the first episode. Of Final Fantasy VI. Um, guys, um, as this is the first episode, uh, let me know if this was a good length for you guys, if you want me to make it longer, if you want me to make it shorter, and uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy it. Um, like I said guys, um, this is going to be a long series, so I'm probably going to bring this out like every now and then, just for like a change of pace, so um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, let me know what you think about this so far in the comments below, and I'll see you guys next episode. Anyways, thanks for watching guys, if this was like, very enjoy it, subscribe for me and see you guys next video, whatever I make, keep watching. Ciao!